Hello, friends. It's me, and it's time for another fantastic story from our friend Shakespeare Hemingway. <laughs> this is Garfield Royal Rescue. You're never going to guess what this one's about, I'll be completely honest with you, so here we go. Garfield was relaxing, having some scotch and lasagna, when John Arbuckle came in with emergency news. Garfield, it is terrible, I have the bad news, John Arbuckle said with crying words. Stop your sob stories and give me your thoughts, Garfield said with serious demands. It's terrible, Garfield. Kate Middleton and Prince William are getting married, but you are not invited. <laughs> John Arbuckle said, with outrage. This is lies, roared Garfield with angry voice. It's true. Look and see, John Arbuckle showed Garfield a letter that came through mailboxes. Dear Garfield, you are not invited to the royal wedding. Sincerely, Royal England Family, said the letter with insult. Invite this, Garfield shouted as he tore up the letter with manly hands. This is the last straw. I will not stand for insults to humanity. <laughs> How are they insults to humanity? <laughs> Garfield cried out to the ceiling with fist clenched with justice. What will you do, Garfield? Asked John Arbuckle with wondering. I will do what any good man does when insulted with words. I will crush wedding with righteousness. Garfield roared with determination. It will be dangerous. Royal edicts will be there with power, John Arbuckle warned with caution. The only edict I serve is my fist, Garfield said as he walked out with intentions. Meanwhile, in England, Buckingham Palace, Prince William and Kate Middleton were getting ready for marriage ceremonies. That was one sentence, no punctuations. Kate and Middleton, soon we will be in marriage, and all will be well. You will be Princess of England, and all will bow to you, said Prince William with celebration. Yes, I am happiness, but I wish Garfield was here. I am missing Garfield's macho charm and rugged good looks. Oh, God. Kate Middleton said with distant longing. Forget Garfield. He is not coming as long as I am prince of this land. You will be mine and mine alone, said Prince William, grasping Kate Middleton tightly. But, said Kate Middleton with whimper, there will be no buts for you. No cat, no matter how manly, will steal my woman, shouted Prince William with anger. Why is it always this story? Oh, Garfield, cried out Kate Middleton with wanting. <laughs> what the fuck? Meanwhile, Garfield was getting ready for his trip to lovely country of England. Time to prepare for my British vacation. My souvenir will be flaming vengeance, Garfield said as he packed his things. Garfield. Be careful of stress. It is killer with heart disease and cholesterol, said John Arbuckle Ward. John Arbuckle warned with advice. What the fuck? <laughs> Why is that in there? I have no time for stress. There is British damsel that needs saving, Garfield said with stern voice. Farewell, John Arbuckle. Hold down fort when I am gone, Garfield said as he left for adventure. You know it, Garfield. Show them what real man is made of, John Arbuckle said as he grasped Garfield's arm for manly handshake. Garfield then boarded his jet and lifted off for takeoff with thunder-like speed. Garfield soared through the sky over oceans and oceans until he came to Island of England. Garfield then braked his jet and prepared for jumping. Time for a British invasion said Garfield as he leaped out of jet into country of Great Britain to administer justice like a prime minister of iron. <laughs> what? Garfield opened his parachute with lasagna logo, but was in no mood for playtime. Parachutes are for little girls and babies in wheelchairs, said Garfield as he cut his parachute off for free fall fun. Meanwhile, in Buckingham Palace, Prince William was dressing up in wedding clothes. All of a sudden, he sensed great power. No, it cannot be. It must be my imagination playing tricks on me, said Prince William with self-delusional fear. Prince William, we are almost ready for the wedding, said the servants. Very well, I am almost ready. Now leave before I am lashing your back, 
roared Prince William with anger. Yes, my master, said the servants with cowering. Why is it always like an evil guy? And it, like, oh, it's, it's the same story, just different ways. The Queen of England entered Prince William's room with words. This is your special day, yet I am unsure you have proven true manhood, said the Queen of England. I am true man. All of England will see, said Prince William with defiance. Why have you not invited Garfield? Do you fear to face a real man? Even the Queen of England knows about Garfield. <laughs> Asked the Queen of England with challenge. I fear no man or cat, shouted Prince William as he tossed champagne glass at mirror, shattering all into millions in fits of anger. I am the prince of all English. All will cower before my monarchical might. <laughs> so he knows what a prime minister is, but he still thinks the monarchy's in charge. That's interesting. Not even Garfield can defeat me, declared Prince William with royal decree. Meanwhile, Garfield was walking in streets of London with purpose. As Garfield walked with strength steps, Englishmen cheered him and shouted his name with joy. Garfield! Garfield! cheered the Englishman as Garfield walked to Buckingham Palace. Garfield walked with sternness and determination to destination, for he was on mission. Garfield walked and walked until he came to Buckingham Palace gates. No gate can take my power, Garfield bellowed with majesticness as he punched down the gate with one punch. Garfield marched with purpose in feet as stormed to wedding palace of matrimony. That's a hell of a sentence. Royal guards came rushing to arrest him, but they were not of match. There is Garfield! Arrest him in the name of the prince! shouted the guards with princely loyalty. Relax, my English hombres. You are being relieved of duty, said Garfield chilly as he hit royal guards with fist and feet of speed like typhoons, sending them flying miles high and exploding. <laughs> Chill out, but I will kill you with an explosion. Okay, cool. <laughs> Garfield picked up a guard and raised him high in air like feather. Here, why not enjoy delicacy of fresh fish and chips, quipped Garfield as he tossed the guard into the sea. There's plenty of salt for you in there, said Garfield with cleverness as he walked away. Garfield marched on his mission until he came to wedding parties with food and drink. More guards came for ambushing, but Garfield handled it like man. It is tea time. Have a sip, said Garfield as he took a tea kettle and tossed it at the guards. Ah, oh, no, cried the guards as tea melted them into skeletons. <laughs> what? Why? <laughs> Garfield came on a table of food with wedding guests sitting around on celebration. Ew. No lasagna? What is this blasphemy? Garfield roared in anger as he threw table on wedding guests. Lasagna is food of warriors and kings. Do not be forgetting this, you worms. Garfield roared as he walked on. <laughs> so, so far, Garfield's just walking around trashing shit, and that makes him the manliest man. Garfield soon came upon wedding ceremony with Prince William and Kate Middleton at altar being wed. Everyone heard Garfield's manly footsteps like thunder in the sea. Prince William turned around and saw his fears become realities. Garfield! yelled out Prince William in tones of squealing horror. How rude! Have you not heard royal tradition? It is the rules that I am first to have woman before marriage. Say what now? Garfield stated with cold fact. Garfield, you will never have my woman. I am prince above all, declared Prince William with arrogant laugh. Garfield looked at Prince William with eyes of seeing and spoke with words of saying. <laughs> okay. Even princes must obey the law of the fist. But do not be worrying, for I will give you a fair trial. Here is the judge, and here is the jury, Garfield said as he raised his two fists for showing. Enough nonsense! Feel the might of royal jewels, said Prince William as he snapped his finger. At Prince William's command, noise was heard. Mighty Big Ben transformed into giant laser cannon and aimed at Garfield with blasting intent. Tick tock, it is twelve o'clock. Time to die, said Prince William with mocking words. At these words, Big Ben fired at Garfield with beams of fury. However, Garfield was not laser phased and backhanded laser beam away with ease. Impossible, cried out Prince William with shock. <laughs> 
Do you not learn? Did you not learn physics in print school? <laughs> Lasers bounce off my mighty man muscle. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Garfield tutored with teachings. I silence your mockery forever! Die! yelled Prince William as he took out long sword and thrust it at Garfield, but Garfield caught his arm in midair and crushed his bones with crab like grip. Looks like your time has just run up, quipped Garfield as he tossed Prince William into Big Ben, exploding them both. No, cried Prince William as he crashed into Big Ben for an explosion. Good night, sweet prince, said Garfield with cool words as he walked away. After victory, Kate Middleton ran to Garfield and embraced him with arms. Garfield, thank you. When I was marrying him, I only thought of you. Wow. Thanked Kate Middleton with gratitude. No problem, my British biscuit. <laughs> You must save me a juicy piece of your shepherd's pie. <laughs> Garfield responded with flirtations, dear God. We <laughs> Garfield, you're a true hero and real man. We want to make you an honorary king of England, Queen Elizabeth said with royal orders. I am sorry, but I am busy living fast life and fast adventures and faster women. Garfield rejected with sympathies. Very well, at least accept position of Duke of Ireland. <laughs> said the Queen of England. Fine, but I must be attending to important business, said Garfield as he picked up Kate Middleton and brought her to royal bedroom where he could show her how a real men love women. Garfield, please make me your queen, said Kate Middleton with warm tone. I do not have a castle to give you, but I have a mighty tower for you to climb, Garfield said with seduction. Garfield, I want you to joust me like a valiant knight. Kate Middleton cried out with desire. Garfield then rode Kate Middleton like mighty knight taming wild stallion. With mighty force, Garfield jousted Kate Middleton with mighty lance into late hours of the night and all heard sound of their romances. The end? Question <laughs> mark? How, how does he do it? How does every one of these keep getting stranger and, and more amazing than the last one? I literally am just... I don't know. This is amazing. And I just... Wow. Just fucking wow, dude. Oh my god. Thank you all for being here. If you enjoyed this, please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that good YouTube stuff. I have a Ko-Fi and a merch store if you'd like to check those out. And if you can't, that's okay too. I have my own subreddit if you'd like to send me your own weird stories from anywhere, really. R slash uh, Stories. It's mine. I'll check it out. Every Saturday there's a live stream. And in the description of this and every video, there's also an address if you want to send me weird things in the mail. And I'll open them on video. Because that's what I do sometimes. I don't know why. Anyway. I love you all so very much. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.